Yeah, so but well, you can go ahead and modify the code first, so. Do I need another one of these void setups? Right. Let's see. Okay, you added LED 2, LED 3, and then you have to change the pin numbers, of course. Pin numbers? See how they're all on 13? You have to put them on different pins. You can pick whatever you like. Okay. And then you're going to have to, yeah, under that void setup, you're going to have to, you see how it says pin mode, LED pin, comma, yeah. output? Mm -hmm. You're going to have to do that for two and three also. So you can just do a copy paste and set them, because that's setting whether they're inputs or outputs. And then in the middle section and then at the bottom in the loop I need to um copy and paste both of these you need to copy just the pin mode yeah just that line of code there ah. you just copy and paste twice oops now you're gonna have to do it three times because you oh, no. deleted the first one I had to do that last time too that's alright okay and then you're also gonna have to uh, are you recording like, this? Mm -hmm. You're going to have to copy and paste those four lines of code down there twice. Depending on how you want to do it. If you want them all to come on at the same time, and whatever, we could try it a couple of different ways. Yep, there you go. And then you just got to change them to two and three mm -hmm. on the LED numbers. Okay. Huh. Okay, Sarah's got her code all written. And she's about to just hook up the output pins from the Arduino and the ground from the Arduino and as you can see we already have our three LEDs and our three resistors, one for each LED, those are 1K ohm resistors and we have each uh, and we have each one of those LEDs hooked up to the uh, excuse me. Each one of those LEDs is also hooked up to the negative uh, negative power line there. So Sarah is going to hook up. Okay, look, she's already got the ground hooked up. Yep, that's the power. Yep, that's going to the power, the ground lead of the power. And then go ahead and hook your three pins up on the Arduino. And you're going to pins 12, 8, and 10 on the Arduino, right? Mm hmm. Okay. And it doesn't matter which LED you go to. But look, you're going to be going over here on the other side of the resistor, okay? Yeah, that's fine like that. I think I might need another one. Do you have another one? I see, I brought you three. I mean four. I thought you, I thought you brought four. Go get another one. Okay, go ahead. Okay, and Sarah's almost got her first modification of the Hello World project. The Hello World project is just one of the LEDs flashing. We played around with that a little bit, changing the uh, rate of the pause and the flash and all that. And then uh, she wanted to add some more LEDs into it, so we did. She basically just copied and pasted the code, made two more LED variables, LED2 and LED3, and uh, let's give it a shot. She's going to plug it in and upload the program. This is our first day with our Arduino. She just got for Christmas.
Hmm? Yesterday. Yesterday, that's right. And she's already catching on pretty quick. Yeah. And this is the book we're working out of here. Arduino, a quick start guide. By Mike Schmidt. Schmidt. <laughs> Okay, she's got... One of them is already working from the previous... Oh, yeah, from the other program. That's well, right. kind of lit up a little okay. bit. So now she's going to hit... Wait, hang on. Let me... Uh, get over there. Let me get over here on the... This. We'll be able to see what's going on. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead now and do Sarah's it hitting the upload. And we should see some activity on the transmit lights. There they there it goes. Transmit receive lights. And now let's see what we have here. Perfect. Perfect. Exactly how I wanted it to blink, go. Blink, blink. It's a perfect uh, time. Speed it up a little bit. No, something's wrong on that middle one, huh? What do you mean? I don't understand what you mean. That's how I wanted it to go. The middle one... The middle one's blinking, but it's staying on longer than the other ones. Did you set it up that way? Mm-hmm. I think so. Does that really matter, though? I mean... Well, why is it... No, it's supposed to turn off. At the same speed. That's LED2. Speed. Oh. Wait, it's your code. Oh, it must be... No, you have it going low and then high. Oh, that must be it, then. Okay. Okay, so... Pause and... Still a little I'll, bit. I'll, I'll zoom in here and let you see our troubleshooting process. Well, let me change it back to the original. Okay. And you can see we have LED pin high, a pause, LED pin low, which is turning it off, and then a pause, LED, LED 2 pin low, LED 2 pin goes low, which it already was low to start, pause, and then it goes high, pause and then LED 3 pin goes high so which means that LED 2 is going to go high is going to still be high while, while LED 3 is going high so you're going to have two on at once the idea was to go high low high low high low and have only one LED on at any given time so Sarah's going to go ahead and fix that code go ahead Sarah make it a little bit faster well no the idea is to only have one LED for now, no, anyway. I, want, I wanted to do like that. No, you, look, you need to change. See? See look, how it says low? There? Can I get in there at least? Go ahead, just scoop the keyboard. I'll need the mouse. Oh, okay. Sorry. So I need to switch high and low up here. Right, exactly. And then that should, that should make it run fine. No, not that one. That oh. one's good. The one below oh. it. LED2 is the one that's not, that's fouling up. Okay, go high. And don't change, don't change the timing of it yet. Let's make sure it works first. And then you can start fiddling with it. Okay. Okay, so let's do a quick, quick check. We got LED pin, 12, 10, 8. Got a 500 millisecond pause. It's fine. And then you're initializing LED, LED2, LED3 as outputs. Going high, low, high, low, high, low. All right. Okay. Now, well, let's try again. Let's, I already changed it to that. Oh, you uploaded it already? Yep. Oh, I didn't realize it. Oh, that's better. Okay, so now it's going blink, blink, blink. Blink, blink, blink. Okay, ready to make, make, ready to make it a little bit faster? Uh, yeah, go ahead. About 100 or? This, this is Sarah's favorite part where she gets to buy the programs. Let's see, what are you doing here? 100. Okay, so she makes a pause 100. It should go five times faster. Let's take a look. Transfer. Bing, 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 bing. There we go. Okay, let's try about 200. No, that, that's good. Okay. Sarah. What? Turn around. Good Hi. job. Congratulations on your first project with the Arduino. Bye-bye. <laughs>